Hello, Wargamers! Luca and Steve here from MiniWarGaming.com, bringing you some old world action. Today, it's a race to the finish line in an attempt at trying something a little different between the Beast of Chaos, or the Beastmen, and the Orc and Goblin Tribes, specifically the Nomadic Wa list today. It will be 2,000 points in today's game as these mighty forces clash upon the battlefield. We play and call it work. The general of my Beastman army will be this Doom Bull here. One of uh, probably the best fighty characters in the game. Uh, I mean, stats-wise, points, hard to argue. He's a little expensive, obviously. Look how big that axe is, too. Jeez. There's a lot of cool build paths you could go with a Doom Bowl here. Uh, for now, I think he's best, honestly, with a hand weapon shield. But I bought him a great weapon and no shield just because he doesn't have the shield bit yet. It's not going to be that detrimental. But I think that's his best build. Uh, for his magical items, I bought him a Talisman of Protection, so he's got a 5 up board save. And for magical armor, I invested a little bit more points into the Pelt of the Dark Young. Uh, giving him, with his heavy armor... Uh, four up save. But we bought him Gnarled Hide uh, for a Chaos Mutation, so you actually have a three up save. That way, with the shield, you could have a two up save on him, uh, which isn't too bad at all. And one could argue that his right arm there, completely covered in armor, is a shield, and that's fair. I had a few points left over on him, so I gave him Gouge Tusks for further armor penetration on his attacks in case he needs it. And... A Dark Heart, so he can heal a wound. Why not? He can eat a Dark Heart and gain a wound back if he needs it. I just had 25 points left over on him. A little bit of an awkward fit in the list, but I do like to run wizards. I mean, when you're trying to build something a little bit more uh, interactive in the game, at least for the defensive purpose. We had a great Bray Shaman. Uh, we kept him dirt cheap, Ruby Ring of Ruin, and an Earthing Rod. He'll be running a Demonology today. Moving on to core, I have three Tuscore Chariots because we want to go fast. Moving on to core, one of these two units of Minotaurs can fill a slot of core, maxing out my 500 points, including the Tuscore Chariots there. Uh, in the back, we have... They're identical squads, full command, except... The squad in the back there has great weapons, and the squad out front has hand weapons and shields. I should note the Minotaurs with great weapons in the back bought the Man Bane standard to actually get my core to 500 points. A little bit over 500. And the rest of my list, that is right, folks, you guessed it. Uh, we got two Gorgons and a Chaos Giant. Now, one of the Gorgons takes up the slot of special because I have a Doom Bowl General. And uh, the other Gorgon in the middle and the Giant will be part of my rare allotment. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any points to give any Giant upgrades. He's a bare bones Giant. Couldn't buy regen, couldn't buy heavy armor. Taking a look at the War Boss. For the Nomadic Wa, we have Orc War Boss on a Wyvern. No Black Orcs today. We have two hand weapons because that's what we're armed with. We got heavy armor and a Grizzly Trophy Rack. is a new item from the Arcane Journal. Aura of Minus One Leadership. And the terror on the mount should help out there. We also have troll hide trousers because all orcs these days with any status wear the pants of a troll. And then we have the talisman protection for a little bit of protection. Oh, we do have a second command here: a goblin war boss on a, a wolf chariot. There is an extra wolf upgrade. He also wears the pants of a troll, and he has the armor of silvered steel and a great weapon. I got a, a level four orc weird knob with just the lore master upgrade on a war boar. That's it. The rest of my army is two, sorry, three orc board chariots, but one more to the other side of the table. I got a pair, uh, two units of goblin wolf riders, skirmishing with shields and spears, a, a champion and a musician in the squad. We have veteran orc boar boys with all the trimmings and the frenzy banner, because why not? Ooh. We got three goblin wolf chariots. Here's the other squad of goblin wolf riders. My core unit of uh, orc boar boys, all the trimmings. And uh, they've already vanguarded up, but that is my 2,000 points of the nomadic wall. And there is this one giant as oh, yeah. well. Oh, yeah. He's hiding in the trees. And, yeah, no upgrades on him. Today's sponsored battle report is brought to you by Wayland Games, a massive distributor of all things, I'll say nerdy. They obviously a lot of wargaming related stuff because, well, you know. Uh, they're based out of the UK. Uh, they have massive quantities of stock as well as competitive pricing for what they offer. And they do much more than just wargaming. They got hobby supplies, terrain to go along with it, board games, trading card games. Uh, you know, it's a, just a great place to go if you're looking for... Uh, a fix. They're a massive supporter of Mini Wargaming, so consider supporting Wayland Games if you're thinking about picking up some new supplies, maybe a new army, a couple new extra models, a few extra kits here and there. 
Before we get into the game, everyone, I do want to remind you all a couple of things. For all of our members on YouTube and our Vault members on MiniWarGaming.com, Steve and I do a post-game show uh, on Mini Wargaming connected to this video. We're going to talk about this battle report and just the old world in general. Uh, so if you want like a little bit of a podcast that is available for our members to show our support uh, for all of the support that you do provide us, it allows us to make all this content for free on YouTube. In addition to that, if you're liking the old world content and you want more of it, Steve and I live stream and re-upload those live streams in an edited down format over at Mountain Miniatures. If you want to check out that channel, it's just pretty much purely old world content now. Uh, Steve does like sit and talks every Sunday, just talk about the game and the hot topic of the week. If you want to chat in, chime in there and kind of learn a little bit more about the game if you're interested or just, you know, hang out and say hi. That is uh, every Wednesday. Thursday and Sunday are streams. Wednesdays and Thursdays are actual gameplay, and that is at uh, 5.30 EST, our time, uh, on the East Coast here of North America. And uh, also, if you want to come by and play the Old World, this is the last announcement before we get to the game, I promise. We're always looking for guests uh, for all of the games we play, uh, specifically Old World. I know a lot of you out there are working on your armies, getting them ready, but we are in Welland, Ontario. It's near Niagara Falls, so if you aren't too far away and you want to Drive on over and give us a visit and play some old world with us. Go to miniwargaming.com slash challenge for all the details. You'll talk to Josh. You'll figure it out with him. Heck, even if you're just visiting the falls or family or friends nearby, you know, give us a shout. Maybe we can fit you in. We play other games as well, but this is old world battle report. This is an old world battle report, so a little relevant for the old world. But we'll do Sigmar. Got a new edition around the corner, 40k. I'll do, I'll do Lord of the Rings any day of the week. So, I mean, any game really. So, we'll see you then. Thanks for tuning in and uh, hope you enjoy this one. It, uh went very differently than we thought it would. Steve and I here rolled for a battle line deployment. Honestly, I, did, I, I, I always kind of feel a little suspicious when we get battle line, because I feel like you guys think we're lazy. But battle no, line, we no, just battle actually... line's just one of the missions. We get battle line every now and then. I don't think anyone's That's ever made a comment, missions. but I feel self-conscious about playing battle line missions. Every time I see the one, I'm like, ah, oh, people are gonna hate us. But I think you got, battle line is your standard game, right? That's what it is. So we are fighting in the woods. Uh, in one of the orc encampments that they set up kind of quickly as they wah around, right? Uh, for the nomadic wah, and no one cares who wins this game. Literally no one. No, this the, is carnage. This, this is carnage of the game. This is, uh, Bretonia is happy about this fight. Empire is happy about this fight. The Border Princes are happy about this fight. The Everyone. orcs are happy about this fight. Yeah. The beasts are happy about this fight. <laughs> Everyone. Everybody's happy about this fight. <laughs> this game could go sideways for either one of us very quickly because yep. these are all out aggression lists. I deployed on the line. Knowing that his two units of boar boys, which I can't remember which one's the biggins, but they're the biggins. They're the biggins. Yeah. They both have vanguard, <laughs> and they could just charge right away if they make the charges. And they have warband. They get to reroll it. Uh, they could be quite fast and quite deadly. Uh, and then for my deployment, quickly, I just have a chariot, my wizard, who has no protection in this list, by the way. That's why it was a little of an awkward pick. But I was debating on putting him on a chariot, but we just don't have the model for it. So on foot's good enough. Working on it. Working on it. And then that all that would also mean I wouldn't get my core built properly with this list. Either, you actually so. want that? You want to run that guy in a chariot? No, only for this one random gotcha. list I would have right there because gotcha. it would have given him a little bit more protection. I have a chariot with no riders on, so you can put characters on and off. So oh, that's yeah. that's a good idea. That's actually that would work out quite well. Uh, and then the other chariot, one gorgon giant. Uh, these are the great weapon bowls. Uh, they have the, the fancy banner, doom bowl general in the middle, hand weapons, uh, gorgon, and the other chariot. That's it. Uh, I think I finished deploying first. Because I had fewer drops. That makes sense. So I, I am get a die ready. Going to roll it. I will roll my die. A three, I a got whopping a three. Three. I'm to with see you. See who will go first. Steve gets also a three. So that's a reroll, I guess. Yeah, four and five. Ooh, turn one for the orcs and the goblins. I like it. I should note if you're unaware of how battle line works, it's whoever has the most victory points at the end of six rounds wins the game. Uh, and it's whoever wins the roll-off goes first. Uh, standard deployment, we're going to be about 24 inches apart, other than these guys who vanguarded, and Steve's going to go first. You have your command phase. Yes, uh, I have supposed to cast right away. We're going to do Here We Go. Here We Go, and that's going to be on Mr. Shaman back yep. there. Yes. Uh, six. Plus four. Uh, that's enough. It's that's a nine a to cast. Ten. And what does that do? I, I know what it does. I'm going to add D3 to my charge rolls, my guys in command range. Oh, and his command range is right... Well, touching those two guys right there. So they're Swift Stride and an extra D3 on top of it. And Warband, that we're totally not going to forget. We're not going to forget Warband. Lots of us actually have Warband this game. We're going <laughs> <we're gonna, we're laughs> to hopefully remember our Warbands. Try to fade to dispel that. My wizard is too far away to dispel it as of right now. So 11? No, not even, even if my wizard was in range. Let's also do an Evil Sun Shining in my command range. Improve AP 1 and reroll 1s to hit. 
Five? That's just enough. It's a nine to cast. Can't stop it. My faded is done. And we got a couple of buffs off, and... That is it for the command phase, or conjuration step of it, and, uh... I think it's time to charge. Oh, where do you want to start? Uh, I think everything I charge into... Okay, so they're gonna go ahead and... They have to throw a charge. They're because friends. They, they, have, they have the frenzy banner. Um, is that a nomadic wa thing? Uh, it's, well, it's a new banner from the Arcane Journal, but it doesn't have to be nomadic wall. Oh, it's just a new one. Like, it's gonna be on my Black Orcs on foot every time going forward. That's not Furious Charge and Frenzy. Nasty. Um, I don't think this is a good fight for me. I don't, I couldn't tell you, dude. This is, this is gonna be dice the game. We're gonna do it. <laughs> okay, uh, which one um, do you want to charge? I think I, I have to make accidental contact with everything, right? So, it's just really bad for me. Oh. I I'm just gonna do this. I they, I'm just gonna pull things back, so we don't have to worry about that. Everything. Then is, I'll go for the Gorgon. <laughs> there, everything staggered on the deployment on the accidental contact thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything staggered on the deployment. Uh, we'll hold with the Gorgon, and they're charging these guys. We're gonna hold. Everything's gonna hold. All right, we're, let's we're, roll this we're, one first. We'll see what the dice look like. So we're gonna get a six plus a swift stride 15, and a D three. 11, 12 plus what? Seven. Yes. Nineteen inches. That's definitely good. Making contact there again, just staggering these guys out so we don't have to worry about the accidental contact stuff. Just okay. do it again. Uh, okay. Oh, interesting. <laughs> One, Swiss stride. Seven. And D3. Eight plus. Oh, that might fail. That is a fail, but we're going to remember Warband. Warband! Re roll. So six right, high. There we, there we go. go. Swift stride. Seven, eight, nine. It's, a, <laughs> it's like the same. Seven, eight, nine. 16. Oh, no, 16. 16. That's off by one. Ooh, because we're, did you get a 15 last time? We we're off by two. Now you're off by one. Did I roll double ones last time? You did roll a double one last time. No, I got a six. Yeah, but then you rolled a five. Oh, then I rolled. But you rolled better. Well, okay, we're going to double check it anyways. Wait, you rolled... I, I, I can totally do math while the camera's running. Yeah, so we rolled. So 24 inches apart. Yes. I vanguarded you... seven. Yes. So and we're. And I'm adding. Oh, they make it then. Yeah, you vanguard seven, you're good. You're yeah, in. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome. Welcome to the fight. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is a fail. They move, uh, it's a 16 inch charge, and. Uh, yeah, 23, we, we can totally 23 do away, right? Yeah. We can totally do math. So they're going to fail forward there. That's not uh, good for them. Be... Uh, Rolling the one on the swift stride and the two on the extra double swift stride from the here we go was not great there. Uh, and then no, there was no other charges, so we're going to go to remaining moves. Oh, sure, right, no. I assume everything's coming at me. Full send, my dude. Full well, send. you said three quarter send. Uh, well, three quarter send means we charge what we can, and then the rest is runs on forward. All right. Full send is when everybody's charging who can. Wait, <laughs> wait, no, that was a full send. Never mind. Yeah, full send is everyone who can charge. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you're right. We're back. We send everything on forward. Send the wolves on forward, chariots on forward. These guys held back a little bit. So there's the three quarter send. And then these <laughs> kind of all moved up. We do a little bit of a posture with the chariot thing here and sending the boss men. Yeah. Hopefully down the flank. I'm out charioted by the goblin war boss chariot because he's got wolves. I have big piggies. <laughs> so his, his maximum charge range is 18 because of Swift Stride and movement 9. My guys are moving 7, no Swift Stride, so this chariot is outclassed by yours, sadly. So we're going to have to worry about that, but I think I'm feeling confident all the same. What do you got for shooting magic? Well, the only... I wanted to hit the giant, but he's not in range. I have to hit the Gorgon with a Vindictive Glare. It is the cast play 8 strength 7 D3 wound thing? Yes, Vindictive Glare is a nasty uh, spell. That's 6, 10 total? 10 total. You're out of range of my wizard. This is oh, a yeah, strength 7... A hit. Uh, I'm gonna. I already faded this spell. Oh, yeah, that's right. You, you got it. I'm uh, gonna have a three. That's a wound. Uh, D3 damage. I do have regeneration on him, I believe. But it will be two damage if I fail it. The Vindictive Glare burns through regular armor, but not regeneration. No, he takes it. He has four remaining wounds. Came down to four. What else you got there? Yeah, one more spell. Probably what do you think we'll do the Gaze of Gork. It goes off. It's gonna roll five d six in a straight line. Where, we're gonna go. Thinking? We're trying to get to your giant, I guess, or even the bulls. Just this way. But let's see. Oh wow! Oh, nice geez, roll. That's a perfect. Roll. Oh, Sixteen twenty one. Really. Yeah. One's gonna land. Ah. Yeah. We know it doesn't hit him, so we're good. All right, fair. And that's it for oh, shooting. Oh, no bulls because I marched. Oh, they marched. Gotcha. Okay. What do you? Uh, I we have move? this squad right here. Well, you definitely have initiative on the gorgon. That's for sure. Well, we have four impact attacks. Oh, bring it on. On sixes. Or you're not like strength five on theirs, or definitely not uh, one, it's one, the three. Strength of the boar, which yeah. gets plus one strength for its, me uh, its melee weapons in combat, but the impact says use the strength of the boar, so I don't think you get the plus one strength. So I think three. this was uh, there was something about, I remember this came up in the last game we played. They make the boar's impact hits as strong as the boar's melee attacks in the nomadic wall. Kind of like its impact hits. Or well, is it the wording is uh, yeah. there's a Tusker charge special rule that yes. says their their hand weapons. Uh, count as strength four when they charge. Yes. But the impact attack says use the strength of the boar, which is strength three. Now, all the same, not a great roll for weeks. We got spears, though. We're going to be fine. Uh, we're hitting on fours. Yes. These are not the biggins. These are not the biggins. These are not the biggins. And these mean uh, with choppas and spears, is strength five? 
three, four. Oh, five. yeah, you're right. I was thinking straight four. You're right. Yeah. So five to wound? We have two. two. It's going to burn through my light armor on the Gorgon, but he does have regeneration. Uh, he fails both. Oops, brain fried on choppers. This reroll wound rolls a one, and um, we used old choppers. Rules. Yeah, the old chopper rules. So only wound only rolls one, one wound went through, but I have one to reroll because Didn't choppers. Matter. Didn't matter. Okay, so one wound still failed my save or regen to have five wounds on the gorgon, and you got your piggies. Piggies. And we all know they get to all attack now. Yeah. Thank new you. FAQ. Thank you, FAQ. Oh, uh, we have one at AP one. AP one because of the piggies. Uh, that is my regen, and I fail it. The six of regen. He's down to four. All the same. I'm supposed to do a Primal Fury check on the Gorgon. I got a seven. Hey, he passes. Gorgon has Frenzy, uh, but he's also got Blood Greed as a rule. So his Frenzy is actually two attacks instead of one. So his five attacks go to seven attacks, hitting the Pig Riders on fours, I believe. No ones through roll, but I'm going to double. What's the... Oh, no, no, you mean on threes. I'm up to skill higher? Yeah. Go... You hit you on threes. And no ones through roll for Primal Fury. These are twos to wound. Ooh, that's a dead guy. Unless I don't have Killing Blow. You have Killing Blow and Monster Slayer. Oh, it's both? All right, so we kill a piggy and five saves of minus two. Uh, three ups? Kill three. Three up to five up on their save, yes. Oh, Wait. that... Five up save, Steve makes three of them there. Uh, we got a weird brain fart there. I have stomps <laughs> now, though. Uh, D3, uh, little steps. One, dance, 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 dance. You're, you're a behemoth, right? Yes, I am. I kill one more piggy. Uh, you always go behind. Yep, leave him back there. Uh, combat resolution. All right, I believe I'm going to win this one. I killed four piggies. Boom. And I have closed order the human strength of five or more, because that's how it works now, which is technically how it worked before, but it was a little bit more vague before. The FAQ definitely uh, good a ride on that one, I think. I think that's it. I got combat resolution of five. Your closed order with human strength of five or more. You got a banner. You did two damage. Am I missing anything? Uh, I want you to miss one thing. <laughs> Banner, close order, two damage. You won by one. And I'm terror as well. So your leadership is modified by one. <laughs> we don't care about no terror. Oh, we're scared. Yeah, they do care about All terror. Right, um... I have to chase. So, <laughs> yeah. And you're running, you should be running pretty much directly away at a, maybe a slight angle. Uh, Swift striding it. I'm going to, I don't have Swift strike. So you're going to go 13. I can't catch you. And I'm going to end up going eight. We'll show you where they end up. That's where they end up running, and it's going to run through the goblins. It's pissing wolves. Oh, oh they're okay. They're panicking. Uh, uh, Swift strike. I might as well add it. Yeah, double one. <laughs> get past these guys. And they're going to run from these guys. Yeah. Right, my Gorgon ends up chasing, uh, I believe it was eight inches to there. Uh, and that's where they end up panicking as well, or fleeing to. Oh, they actually only fall back in good order. So they rally. Oh, that's, uh, yep. So they would have gone, yeah, interesting. <laughs> it's actually funny. They just fall back in good order, technically. That works so well for me. And uh, Steve rolled a double one. You don't add Swift Stride to it. They just rally automatically. So they're exactly where you put them initially. I want, that's not yeah, where I want them to be. Exactly. So nothing really changed there. <laughs> I need to re change my direction now, whatever. Uh, I believe that's the end of a glorious Nomadic Quad turn one. Gorgon, we, we, we heard two Gorgons. Gorgon overpowered. On to my turn one, command phase. He is going to beckon the gaze of the gods over here and hopefully not get stupidity immediately. Oh, uh, ah, <laughs> ah, witness me! <laughs> Try and put a token there to remember that. Well, it doesn't have to worry about that until turn two, at least. Uh, that's command phase. Nothing to really do other than conjuration stuff. Start this off by casting demonic vigor. Oh, by the way, my spells, I have demonic vigor. Gathering Darkness, the summoning from the, I took that's the signature spell. Also has Deed of Shadows, which will only be, I mean, it's relevant to the the, the Minotaurs because they're infantry. Oh, they're, no, they're not regular. They'll only be relevant to him, I believe. You know, it is relevant to the Minotaurs as well because it only references basic infantry. It references infantry as a whole, so monsters infantry do count. Anyways, uh, yeah, we're going to cast that enchantment. Demonic Vigor. Ah, oh, we got it. It's all yours? Yeah, fair. I believe I want that on the Minotaurs with the great weapons. Uh, only because the range uh, thing. Oh, I guess I could make the chariot charge a little bit easier, but... That's not, uh, No, this one is any target. Oh, any target? Yeah, demonic vigor is any target. Plus one Do toughness, it. plus one movement, Do and it. initiative. No, I'm just going to go over here. Do it. No, nah, because I didn't tell you about demonic vigor. <laughs> no, it's all care. good. I know you, you don't... You still got to get... You gotta get the I know you don't care. This I care. I'm the one who cares. The God of War wants it. No, he's going to leave. He's out of here. You coward. <laughs> uh, he is. Look at him. <laughs> Think gathering darkness is going to matter, but I'm going to cast it anyway. Oh, we're miscasting <laughs> it, baby. That's a fiver. His brain suffers a calamitous detonation. It's a strength. It's a little blast. It's only going to hit the shaman. Uh, strength six hit and AP two. Uh, that is enough to. He's T five, isn't he? He is T five because he is great. He is, he is great. <laughs> he is a great Bray shaman. He is okay. Oh, uh, gonna move on to uh, charge phase. Charge step of the uh, movement phase. Uh, this guy's got to charge. He's gonna charge. 
the goblins, I guess. I only have two charges. They, he has terror, though, so they got to do a terror check. Six? Good. Yeah, where's your, yeah, he's right there. They're good. Uh, and then, so that's that's a charge there. We're going to have these guys charge. Uh, we're going to go chariot, goblins, minotaurs, orcs, doom bull, orcs, minotaurs, orcs. <laughs> that one's going to be a tough charge. I don't know. Maybe they just kind of move around. Uh, yeah, whatever. They'll, they'll charge. And then giant into... That's it. That's all my charges, I guess. Well, uh, they both got um, uh, flight and flight. So yes. we're going to do this one first. They're going to flee. Flee. Uh, I think 10 will... They take only the one die. I think, oh, sorry. I think six will be plenty. The automatically rally. Yep. Oh, no. They, they flee the automatically rally. I'm fi thinking of fire and flee. Is the, you oh, yeah, I'm not doing... Correct. Oh, it's a regular... Yeah. Uh, is it a regular... Flight over there, just a proper flee. They're going to just stand and shoot. Yeah, there's, there's no point in fleeing for them. They're, they have no purpose in this game. Which one do they want to stand and shoot at? Who charged them? Uh, both units. Oh, uh, I thought that she did. Yep. Um, I'll fire him. Okay. So we're hitting on four. Fives for stand and shoot. Yep. And then sixes. Nothing. Okay. Uh, and then that's... And then what about them? Are they holding? They're frenzy, my dude. Okay, yes, they are holding. Excellent. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, this chariot has to test to redirect because the goblins... Uh, Boo ran away. Five. He's good to redirect. He's going to redirect at the frenzy boys there. So they're charging the boys. He's charging them. And they were also charging them, but that's going to be hard because they're in the way now. Oh, yeah, this thing redirecting them prevents a counter charge as well. Interesting. Huh. We're going to start here and work our way down for these charges. So the chariot moves seven plus six. So that's going to probably be in. He will actually connect with that. He has to go past the woods first and then wheel around the woods. But that will be a good charge. Wheel one inch and then collide with the, the rest of the movement he has. These minotaurs here, uh, movement six. Uh, movement six plus five. Eleven works for them as well, so they both make their charge. Now the Doom Bowl. Uh, oh, jeez. He's probably definitely going to make that. <laughs> They're all going to make it in there, and then I guess I could just do them, and then I can resolve these ones. Oh, I didn't even consider the uh, front. I figured one of them was going to fail, so I declared all the charges, so the Chariot's going to be the one to fail there, because yeah. uh, they're going to take up all the room. Well, this is weird. I didn't expect all three of them to make it. Uh, I actually expected only one or two of them to make it, so I charged with all three just in case. Because they make it, they... Complete the. They literally cover the exact frontage of the boars, and uh, they and made some. and some, and they move. They rolled just enough, just enough on their charge that they can't even wheel a millimeter to make it. So they have to go straight in. But I could have them fail as far as we and have these guys going. I'm just gonna have these guys going, and that means they're gonna fail their charge. Uh, yeah. See what I mean? Look at look at what I'm working with here. <laughs> I take up so much room. Just so I mean. That means they're going to, uh, he rolled a six, and this one rolled uh, eight, actually, if I recall. So, yeah, it was actually seven on that guy, but that's where he ends up with his fail charge. That's where the tumble ends up on the fail charge. Uh, you're staying there, so let's go ahead and do these Minotaurs charging. They have plus, they're movement seven currently, plus, okay, four. And the, who else is it going Gorgon. The Gorgon. Yeah, the giant wasn't doing anything, that's right. The Gorgon, he has to charge. Oh, yeah, it's like a fast. Uh, skirmishers are weird. Skirmishers are weird. <laughs> skirmishers are weird. Uh, this is actually the first time I've charged a skirmish. This is with... not fully clear, but that's the best interpretation. Yeah, this is the first time I've charged. Usually charging a skirmisher unit with one of your units. One, exactly. Perfect, no problem. Two, especially on like two different sides, very confusing. Though, just use a little bit of logic, and this is perfectly playable. Everything about that works. Skirmishers so, are still very loosey goosey. To explain, if anyone wants to get involved in the conversation, uh, there's a thing people tend to get involved in this conversation and forget it. So, skirmishers. Uh, every facing counts as the front. Yeah. And until they're in combat. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Every counts as the front, and then there's a rule saying when multiple units charge an, one uh, an enemy unit in the same facing, they move at the same time. Yeah. Thus the problem. Yeah. So it probably needs an errata, not an FAQ, but it's 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 not necessarily a mechanical problem because this still logically works, right? This is still mechanically playable. It just looks. We're just not yeah. used to how it looks. Well, it's more. Yeah. 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 There's, 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 other, there are other issues that didn't pop up with this. Yeah. What if you were on the far side? Yeah. And I was on... Like, if you had a big skirmishing unit over here, over there, chaining in the middle, and I charged that side and this side, then you got well, problems. Basically, let's say... They, Mark, where that guy is. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, let's say they didn't charge, and he charged them, and he would be like this. 
Right. I have to align the closest model, not be coherent. On a per model to model basis. Yeah, and then have to kill half my unit out of the models that are not coherent. So I, I could have ended up like this. Yeah, because like three guys would be over there and two and guys would be go, over here. Oh, uh, no, coherence, I have to kill. So these would just die out right. And then he just kind of stays there. But or that, overruns that, or that's something. That's an interpretation which makes it, uh, following rules as written, I don't know if that's their intent. So this needs an errata and FAQ type thing, but it's a minor thing. We can totally handle yeah. it. I'll be honest, I my plan was to charge them. I figured Steve was going to flee for sure. And I was going to redirect into them to make them flee again. I passed my stupid leadership six, right? Like, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> I figured tear into one and make them flee with the other, and then the Gorgon is going to run forward like a fool. And, out in the now, open. now I need to double check that I'm not leadership five because the no, no, is... you're because you're within eighteen of him. Oh sure, yeah, yeah, you're leadership that eight. too. Regardless, that's it for my charge moves. I'm going to go to my regular moves now. Uh, we're going to go ahead and cast the Cavain spell, see the shadows on our Weezard. Yeah, that boss is six, bro. <laughs> uh, we got a nine. That boss is six. Yeah. Bless. I oh, didn't even need How the general. How many more skulls do you have? I have a ruby ring and then a the summoning on top of this. Take it. Use that to fly to this side of the giant. Whoosh. We're not gonna march though. We're just gonna go do a normal move twelve. I gotta figure out what to do with this gorgon over here and also these other elements. So I'll be right back. We moved him up seventy lumber. Didn't bother marching. Uh, this giant just. To reform protecting the wizard. I don't really know <laughs> what I want to do with him. I'm going to wait for this to weirdly figure itself out. Uh, and then this chariot backed up three and a half inches away from the goblin chariot with the war boss on it, and he can still charge him pretty easily because he's got war band. And then I didn't know what to do about your chariot here, so I said, screw it, I'm just going to march right up to him. So neither one of it's us get our cool... Pigs. <laughs> we got uh, basic chariots, no charge bonuses, nothing crazy. We're within two of each other, so we'll just uh, dice it off. This is towards Steve's advantage there, but hopefully I'll be okay. And at the end, it's just the Tusk or Chariot, so not the biggest loss. Uh, I'm going to go to shooting. Um, I didn't plan for this. Cast a summoning against them. <laughs> They're in the woods. Uh, yeah, we are. I don't know if we're in 24 of your wizard yet. No. We're... Oh, you were checking. Gotcha. Yeah. Here's my faded. Sure. Uh, no. no. The summoning is 2d6, strength 4 hits. It's going to be an 8. Since four of those boar boys, that's going to be... I'll reroll that one. That's one, two, three wounds so far. Four wounds at minus one. Four ups. Four up. Ooh. Oh, wow. Ooh. Killed four with the summoning. All right, summonings. And then a ruby ring of ruin. I don't know if you can see him anymore. Uh, yeah, you're right, actually. <laughs> Probably. I failed him. Hey, well... Uh, oh, you can still see me. Uh, no, my guy's in the way. My big monster? Yeah. Probably. Yeah. I failed the cast. I oh, rolled okay, a three on the ruby ring anyways. Uh, that's it for my shooting. We're going to go to fighting. I have... I guess we'll just resolve this one. Impact. I'm going to do Primal Fury. See if they get Frenzy. They fail it. and Not Frenzy. It's reroll ones they hit. And, if um, they roll a double, they gain for Oh, because they got Blood Greed. Not Blood Greed. They have the uh, Foe. They have a rule that if they roll doubles. Or is that Foe Render is, is where you AP. get the AP on your weapon. Blood Greed is double attacks for Frenzy. And then there's another rule that pairs with Primal Fury. It's Blood Rage. They do have a lot. Of, there's like uh, They're definitely front-loaded with a bunch of little special rules that kind of define them. Uh, anyways, they fail their check, and uh, the Gorgon, I'll do, he passes, he gets to reroll ones. He already has Frenzy, though. Four impact hits. Twos with an AP of one, because they have uh, Bolgors. Sixes. I, I run three of the Gabos down, and then... Um, I have to pull in this order, everybody. <laughs> I think it's going to be okay, because we're probably going to get him. I assume I have initiative on you. Oh, who's faster? The, it doesn't matter who does it. Gorgon is the one with the initiative here. So he's got seven attacks because of Frenzy. He hits on... Your box kill two? Yeah. Threes. Oh, wow. And twos. Yeah, he kills him. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, he would have killed seven of them. Uh, yeah, we're going to test to restrain and reform these guys. The Gorgon's going to overrun, though. Gorgon's going to go 11 inches. They're, gonna restrain, they're supposed to restrain and reform first. They do. They're going to reform that way to make give him room to get in there. And I'm just going to... Do it again. Uh, yep. Uh, Gorgon has the initiative. He's initiative eight. He charged aside. Uh, and pr Primal Fury impacts first. So Primal Fury on them. Three and a six. They fail. Because he's probably not good leadership. He's leadership eight, so that's a fail. And then Primal Fury on the Gorgon. Passes. He gets to reroll. He rolls a one. Uh, four impact hits going in. Wounding on threes at minus one with the Minotaurs. Uh, it was a four ups. Oh, he'll four. Jeez. Uh, Gorgon. He missed. Uh, this is. Oh, he gets to reroll ones for Primal Fury. Okay, that's significantly better. Weapon skill. Biggins are only weapon skill three yep, still, right? Yep. Okay, yep. Uh, twos. He fails these, and these are minus two. I mean, uh, five up. Five ups. He kills two. All right. And then the Minotaurs get to go. Well, Minotaurs are going to have 13 attacks. They don't have Frenzy, but they do have a Blood Kind in there. 
Uh, we are also weapon skill four, so hitting on threes. No rerolls. They failed their primal fury. Uh, with the Minotaur, their strength five, so threes, and the, because they are attacking with hand weapons and did primal. F oh, did that have to pass their primal fury for fall render? Yes. Okay, so uh, no AP, just so just three ups. Oh, kill one more. one more, and you get to fight, though the champion, I suppose. No, I've only how many did I kill with impacts? Uh. Oh, the Gorgon killed a lot too. Should have the champion and one of those command and, and the Minotaurs. Uh, uh, nothing. Oh, we have Frenzy. Two more Didn't attacks. Matter. Yep. Uh, and then the the Peace. mounts, which the banner is the unit of Frenzy. So yeah. uh, my interpretation is the mounts get it too. Not that it matters here. Uh, okay. All right. Got a D3 sums from the Gorgon. One of them. And it is... Yeah, it's a wound. A minus two. Okay. One more. Uh, let's see uh, if I pass this test. Uh, uh, I do not. Let's do the math. <laughs> I double uh, outnumber you, I think, for the break. Two combat res here, so eight wounds. I did eight wounds to you. Yep. So that's five, six, seven, eight. I have two units strength of five or more in closed order. Get a banner. I got a banner. You're my flank. I'm in your flank. Oh, I have a banner. You have a banner. That's all I got. You don't have closed order anymore. They got, yeah, you have to have at least three models. Of all right, so now. we're definitely fleeing. Yep. Uh, <laughs> five, ten, eleven combat res. So you needed double ones to stay. I uh, fail, so. And you go with that away. Well, the Gorgon has to, uh, the Gorgon automatically restrains and reforms, even though it has frenzy. You can only ever make one pursuit. Move a uh, turn, uh, but the Minotaurs are going to pursue, I guess. So we go. Oh, oh God. I'll, I'll add my. Uh... Actually, my Minotaurs are going to restrain and reform because I won't be able to pursue because the Gorgon's going to. Oh, be oh, I could reform him though. Ah, uh, no, I don't think there's any way I could. I'm going to restrain and reform the Minotaurs. They pass. So you're going to do your flea. I can't because the uh, Gorgon's going to be in my way. I'm going to end up panicking the a wizard. Um, oh, he does. That's a fallback in good order though. So he's only going to go six away from the Gorgon and automatically rally. And that might be a panic check for just the giant. We're good here. That won't be. Oh good. yeah, he's actually probably immune to psychology, or you or that, or you already passed one of the two. And that's uh, about it. Yeah, we're gonna face the chariots. Gonna face the enemies coming that Did way. Did you get within? All right, I'm not playing. <laughs> oh, cause you were gonna goblin chariot him. <laughs> no, it's a totally fun interactive list. <laughs> he's gonna kill me in a different way. Uh, that's it. That's my uh, whatever subpar turn. <laughs> and command phase. I got some buffs to put. Right, uh, to, wi right to wizard stuff. We're going to go to Evil Sun Shining for increase on AP and rend. We got it. What is your fate on that? Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess. 10 total. So, 11. 11. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Uh, no Evil Sun Shining. Here we go uh, for better charges. Uh, 12. I can't stop it. There we go. Yep, you got it. My wizard's too far away. So charge to declare. Uh, oh, you gotta do uh, ra you gotta do your rallies. Oh, wait, rallies. Uh, you have first. a rallying cry too. Rallying cry. Oh, first. rallying cry. Fair, yep. fair, rallying cry. Uh, We're good. They might be. Oh, and minus. They might be under twenty five percent. Definitely under twenty five percent. So double ones only. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, and, and then, then you then just try again with both of them, essentially. They are gonna run. I'll just roll here. Eleven. Jeez. And double one. Not quite. And they're gonna go seven. Hello. Boop. Okay. 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 Uh, so impetuous. I want to not charge right here. Yep. Uh, they are good. You can uh, control. I don't have to charge. Okay. Uh, everybody else, I want to charge. Oh, okay. Fair. There we go. Don't have to worry about impetuous then. Uh, what would you? Uh, we'll figure it out. Didn't know this demonic figure goes away. It's only for the turn. He was ready. Charge. That's one of them. Okay. Charge. Yep. Sorry, yeah, that chariot there. Charge. Charge. Ah, uh, uh, this one. Oh yeah. Uh, everything holds. So go ahead and roll them up. All right, I'll start. We'll start this way. Um, he's in. This one, uh, War Bandit. War Band. He's, he's in. in. Nice. There's goblins. Oh, there's, uh, they take the low die. Oh, it's true. But it's true. They have Swift Stride. Has a one. Uh, they're move nine. Plus uh, yeah. So, so they're ten, eight six plus seven. Oh, that's right. Eight plus uh, seven. Yep, yep, yep. So it's going to be... Uh, Fifteen. Yep. We're plenty. So uh, the giant... I don't think I have to roll. Giants can't fail, but I'm going to roll... Uh, okay. He goes eight. So he'll uh, go... This is, this is he'll wheel one, one and seven. Yeah. And seven. He's good. Yeah. yeah. So we're in about here, though. Oh, you can maximize into this guy. Yep. Perfect. Um, they're holding. Uh, this guy can't fail. Boop, doop, boop. And this one can. Uh... Five plus, so he's, that's 14. No, yeah, what do we, 14 plus three is 17. What do we at? I think it was a, a 16. Oh yes, yeah, so you're good then. Bring it on. Let's do a fight. Ah. Kaboom. Coming over to here. These charges worked out. The giants fighting the minotaurs. 
Uh, the goblins in the front of the chariot. Sorry, the all the bits on the chariots oh, are no. colliding, but they're on the side there. I like this spot. Staying away from my wizard. No, I'm gonna try to. I'm trying to. I'm gonna try to zap it online. Oh, to get my stuff. I get that. And over here, the enemy has been slighted. We don't care. We oh, don't for the care. wyvern boss. Yep. Yeah. Does, does he have friends or anything weird? Impetuous. Oh, sure. Yep. I'm gonna march straight through the woods, land there, and wheel a bunch to face the giant in my wizard. <sighs> Spells. Spell. You just want to keep them where they are. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Eat the gorgon charge. We'll back them up a little bit. They get to go four and a half backwards. Bows, bows first. first. We're gonna throw short bows. Right into the gorgon. Six uh, shots. Fours hit because you're in short range and we don't care about moving. And sixes. Nothing. All right. It's time for vindictive glare. I want to do d3 damage to him. Yes, that's fair. Uh, you got it. I don't have my fated dispel. A wounds on a three. That's a wound. And it'll be one, one damage. damage. Oh, we have a regen. I do have the regen though. Uh, I fail it. We're at three remaining wounds. We're gonna zap a line through all these models. Zap. Uh, enough. You, you got it. And it's five d six. Ooh, oh, right. spicy. Twenty three inch line. We're gonna go hit Gorgon. Hit that Minotaur. Hit this Minotaur. Just zap right down there. Right down this fancy little line. This Gorgon's wound on a five. Ooh. That guy's wounded on a three. That's a wound. And that guy's wounded on a three. These are just wounds each. Uh, Maybe eight, three. Yeah, no, I have no regens on my dudes. Take it on the non-champion there, and uh, <clears throat> technically not the me. Where's my non-champion over here? Oh, there he's over on the side. That guy there. Combats! Oh, I got a Primal Fury I owe you. Oh, you want to do this it's one? It's over, yeah. Primal Fury, I pass. All right, we're going to go impact you first. Yes. One time. Oh, it's D3. Oh, it's uh, two times. Uh, one wound. One wound. Uh, I am gonna roll any AP. Not a heavy chariot, I assume. Uh, not a heavy chariot. So we are okay on our save. Um, Spears on the crew. The uh, little goblin crew. Got a hit. That's a wound. AP one. Strength four minus one. Uh, that's a damage. We're taking one so far. I was gonna mark that like this. And the wolves will be next. Chop 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 chop. Bang 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 bang. Sixes. Uh, four fives. Oh. You only took those four. Oh yeah, your strength three. What I'm talking about. Yeah. Uh, and then my my great axe is faster than you. Uh, ba bam We're hitting on threes and twos. Uh, do goblins get choppers? I don't think they do. About to find out. Uh, no choppers on goblins. I guess we're not surprised. Fair. <laughs> uh, six up saves because it's going to break through my oh, four. No. I take a second damage. My little tusk war is fighting back. Uh, nope. Got the attack with the gore. Uh, that's a miss. And then the best of gore is a great weapon attack. Ooh, that hits. Top, what's your top and sign? Five. A uh, four. So two. Oh, minus three. Minus three. Uh, we have um, armor sword still, so we fail that. Nice. Troll and pants. And troll pants. Ah, that's the combat that's right. Yeah. I'll just double checking. Light chariots are always using strength three. I thought it was like a wound thing, but heavies are five, lights are three, which means heavies always get closed order. I'll be honest, I thought they were unit strength four. So, Not that it's come up yet. We've only played one other game I think since we, then. I think we died. You did two damage to me. Uh, and that's it, I guess. Yep. I did one damage to you because of the regen and closed order, <laughs> and neither one of us have a musician. <laughs> Goblin! <laughs> Let's do this fight. <laughs> uh, yeah, you have initiative on me because you went uh, two inches still. Yep. Uh, so, you wanna do, uh, oh, oh, Primal Fairy, thank you. Yes, I will. I get it. Nice. nice Spears! Um, that's a wound, AP two. Because of Choppas, that's choppers. right. Uh, six up save. We're going to fail that. We're going to take one damage. And then your piggies. Yeah, uh, ba bam. Oh, Fits. Uh, strength. Uh, that's a wound. It is. Yes, and that is a, that's two damage. All right, I will hit you back. My piggies. Oh, nice two hits. I think they're only strength three, so that's a wound. No AP. No We're damage. Good. You should be a four up as well. I have my gore, and then my best gore. Actually, wait. What weapon score are you? I think my gores are four. Yeah, you hit me. You hit me with the gore. Yeah, the gore hits. Uh, the gore wounds. <laughs> and and I got a damage. You don't, have a, you don't have a three up, right? No. Oh, okay, cool. So, uh, combo res I think you win by one because of the damage. Beautiful. I right. am going to run. Oh, we're breaking. <laughs> Chase? Yeah. Um, may I roll? Hey, I got it. <laughs> Where are you yeah. going? Jeez. Not quite far enough, my friend. That's pretty funny. That's pretty good. Uh, Let's do this one first. Uh, Primal Fury. We pass. It good won't enough. matter because we yeah. have 2d6 plus, uh, got 9 plus 2 impact attacks. <sighs> Tear me apart with impact. Freeze to wound. And these should be AP2. They are. So, so I seven? seven, six up saves. Five, seven. I love this. Chariots are so cool. Uh, he's dead. He's just actually shattered to wooden <laughs> pieces. That's <laughs> three strain. Nope, they're going to overrun, but we're, we're going to send the chariots. Right into the Gorgon? Gotcha. Okay. 
Uh, boom. I don't think they could fail, but that guy's gonna make it. The other guy is gonna four. Seven. Yeah, technically a little rough uh, for the one cherry because he's in the front of the Gorgon when he overruns. But it just means it's a disorder charge because he can't properly align because of the gobbos. All right, let's. Uh, and the gobbos couldn't uh, really overrun. So let's, let's do giant things to you. Or they, the goblins would have overran last, yeah. being blocked by the cherry essentially. Uh, let's see what we're doing on the chart. Oh, number six. six. What is six on the chart? Uh, number six in the chart would be jump up and down. Okay. D six plus one hits. Uh, strength of my character. So six hits. I like I like not having to roll the hit, especially with the giant. What is the giant strength? That's probably six, right? Should be six. Yeah, two twos. twos? Oh. Uh, two. Let's see, what's the AP on this? So um, say. No armor saves permitted. So at six, I don't have any wards or anything on them. So at six damage, that's, this guy takes two, uh, and then my musician is next. He takes three more, and then one damage on my banner, bringing it to two. Uh, just they're. They're on corners right now. The banners is being a problem. I'm just fixing that. So I'll have... Uh, th oh, I gotta do my uh, Primal Fury, actually. Uh, we pass. All right, so we got three attacks from the banner and one attack from the champion because he's in the fighting rank. Uh, these are hitting on... Fours? Which web's going to Three. Jimmy on three. No, okay. <laughs> uh, strength five on uh, Minotaur, so five's to wound. Uh, two, two damage. Two wounds? Two damage on your giant. You got four wounds Time left. Time to stomp. I think it's just D6. Is it D6 plus one? Uh, no, I may be saying yes. Four stomps. Uh, twos, three more wounds. Three more. Uh, that's going through my armor, so that's going to put this guy down to two wounds. And technically, it brings the giant over to his corner. Ooh, that's, I like that. There you go. Combo resolution. You did quite a bit of damage to me. Nine, ten damage with that giant. 10 damage with the giant, you have a closed order. I did two damage and that's about it. So I lose by obviously a lot. You have terror, which I got to keep in mind here. And also double out number, ah, you do double out number. I'm unit strength three, unit strength six. Oh, it doesn't matter if I- Oh, I'm, you're running the wrong direction though. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> I'm going that way. I just, I just realized that too. Yeah, we're going that way. Die out right. <laughs> uh, do you want to restrain or reform? Oh, uh, let's find out what direction we're going here. We go ahead and chase. I will go, I think when I flee, I go the full. I don't, blood greed's only on like the, or whatever it is. Yeah, you're going to catch me. So he ends up popping through the units and going there. I do owe you a panic check on, the Gorgon is immune to psychology. These two, well, because he's got friends. These two have to do panic. So go him first. He's okay. And then the Minotaurs, they're, they're okay fine. as well. Okay. okay. Uh, then you're going to just pivot, boom, and end up charging their flank there. Or rather you do mobile take this. <laughs> yeah, that's not bad at all either. Stupidity check I have to do on my upcoming turn, so that could be that could be a crux. Right what back a, in it. Right back a, in everybody. <laughs> that's why fantasy is the best game ever, man. You, never, you have no idea what's going to happen next. It's hard to predict. Uh, two wounds on that guy. That is... You you reforming within three inches of me was more heartbreaking than lose all the poor boys. <laughs> what? I'm just gonna go. I did when I reformed. I only did it so I didn't get flanked. This is not a full send game anymore because <laughs> I didn't charge every time I could. It was supposed to be a full send game, Luca. <laughs> you could have charged. No, I know. <laughs> you could have charged. Well, so you don't I, get impact. I had a decent chance of killing you with magic and spells and bows and stuff. That's true. That's true. Vindictive glare and all that. Okay, well, that's the end of turn uh, two. We're going to go to my turn two. We've already lost, like, half our armies. Well, you've lost... Hordes of greens. Hordes of greens are going down. <laughs> this guy's in a bad spot. I've put it off as long as I can, everyone. I got to do the stupidity check. Um, my doom bowl. He, he, he beckoned the gaze of the gods, and boy, did they look at him. Ah, uh, blah! He's, oh, we're good. And uh, we're obviously going to immediately beckon the gaze of the gods again. So we, we need more stats. Obviously, we don't have enough stats on a Doom Bowl. So let's get more. Ah, five. That's Dark Fury. That's an extra attack. Should be it for the command phase. I don't, he doesn't have Rallying Cry. We're going to go cast a couple spells here. Let's go ahead and cast Demonic Vigor on our... Let's make this guy tougher. <laughs> Let's try and get the uh, toughness going on the bowl. Ah, oh, we got a nine. That's good enough, right? Demonic figure is a nine. And you're uh, out of what else do you got? What else do you got? Uh, gathering darkness. I don't see any relevant targets for it. And I got magic missiles. Two magic missiles. And uh, I can fly 12 with steed. So I can kind of zip away. I mean, this one? I'm going to start this one. Ten on a faded nope. dispel. Five. All right, so we are going to put Demonic Vigor in. That's until the end of this turn. He will have plus one modifier to his movement, toughness, and initiative characteristic. Demonic Vigor could help me if I choose to use my hand weapon or not against that giant. he got to remember the giant is uh, overrunning into them. Does he not go up? Is he not initiative seven? Oh, he's initiative seven yeah, in the yeah. flank. Yeah, so I'd be fighting at the same time if I go with my hand weapon because of Demonic Vigor charging in. It's tempting. I don't know. Cast Gathering Darkness. Ah. Great. We fail. Nine to cast. We can go to the rallying step of this. I'm going to try and rally this 
uh, machine here, this machine of war, this chariot. It's good. I'm just going to face this way, I guess. I don't know why, but we're going that way. All right, then the other... Ra Do I have any other rallies? No, oh, that guy. That guy. He is at 25%, so he's good. He's only negative one leadership to rallying. You have to be under 25% for the insurmountable losses. Uh, he is not a skirmish or anything, so his facing does truly matter. Uh, I need help over there. Charging! We're going to go giant into chariot. I need Char six. Uh, uh, we're scared. Oh, God. So he flees. All right, well, fine. <laughs> hey, fair. Uh, I got no real redirect with him, so he's going to commit to that. Doombull into giant. And uh, Gorgon has to declare charge over Char there. Are they running also? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> no. Seven. Interesting. That ends up there. Uh, I'm going to have to do a test to redirect. Uh, he passes. I'm going to charge the fleeing. I got nothing else I can charge. So I'm going to go four. Wonderful. That's that's it there. Uh, that's it for Dang my charge. I wanted to hold on both of those. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Terror is so strong. For charges, though, this guy's just going to go. Is he going to fit? What's going on here? Let's make it in there. Extra attack, stupidity. Uh, this guy's gonna fail, but he's gonna go forward. Uh, he does go the full 10, though. And close in the distance. The Gorgon moves 7 towards the Boar Boys. We're gonna go... Oh, that's not a bad charge. 13 is a fail. Oh, jeez. I would've caught them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's fair. Send him the 13. Whoosh. That'll bring me to my remaining moves. Uh, we're gonna try and cast a uh, conveyance. Wait, wait, wait. What? Waiting. Wait, hold on. Doesn't actual contact mean you get them if you were to go... Accidental contact would be a thing, but because they're being charged in the rear, they're, the goblins are moved aside an inch uh, to make way for the Gorgon. To get Unfortunate. Over there. Um, remaining moves. I'm going to try and cast my Convince spell, Steed of Shadows, on my Duder here. Ooh. Oh, 10. No, what am I talking about? Eight. Eight. Is nine to cast. No Steed of Shadows. We're I'm going to get you. I might just march. run. Yeah, march. <laughs> march somewhere. Like that way. <laughs> Do a march block on my rallied chariot. It's good. The chariot over here instead. Uh, the other thing to move is that guy. He is probably not March Block, but just in case. All right, now I gotta check. That guy's the nearest thing, so probably not. We're over right away, so he can march normally. Just gonna march to there, wield a little bit to avoid the woods, and we gotta figure out what to do with the wizard. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're gonna March Block him. Eight. He passes. No, the war boss. He's gonna run you over. We're gonna go over there. The war boss is not gonna win that combat. We're fine, we're fine. Uh huh. I'm gonna get charged by this guy. We can go shooting. We can do this combat first, so I'll be sad. Uh, yeah, I gotta do Primal Fury. We pass. Look at that. Uh, you're faster. I am. Well, with this guy. Two piggies and one wound. No uh, AP. Armor. Sir? He's got... Oh, yeah, pants. Pants. Oh, one, one damage. Three. And my not best gore, the regular gore, misses. All right, you get to go. You got All wolves right, uh, and stuff. Wolves. Oh, good start. Uh, nothing. Uh, spears. Got a hit. No. Nothing. Uh, the boss man, which is the same as you, basically. Yep, you go oh, ahead, yours. Oh! Threes! Twos! Oh, no. Maybe three, maybe that's two. A, that's just the damage. I have to make three six-ups. That's not great. All right, so you may have killed it. Yes, but you have to fight. Best of gore. Hit. Uh, strength. Your toughness four, also. Uh, yeah. That's a wound. Uh, so we have an armor save, which we make. Nice. Good job. I'm going to test restrain. Yeah, I fail. <laughs> Wait, he's a regular orc, right? Oh, uh, yeah. He's only eight, yeah. yeah. He's good. <laughs> oh, you overrun. You don't have to... What would you roll for... Uh, roll? No, I rolled a nine. Is that for your, like, overrun? Oh, no, I rolled a ten. Oh, a ten for your overrun. <laughs> so he's going to overrun off the board. <laughs> I will see him later. Wait, I, did, I, did, I did roll it, right? I rolled it. I seen a nine for leadership. Well, I mean, you have two dice here. I don't know what that was for. He's so, checking. Like, yeah, I, I, think, I think I rolled it. I don't remember you rolling it. But that's where you end up. So on the I, overrun. Yeah, so I didn't roll it. Okay, let's see if I can. Test uh, reform after the overrun. You do double ones. Very good. We're gonna get run over. We're, gonna, we're just gonna flee. We're gonna flee. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be fine. We're gonna move this fight on to... Let's do this Gorgon. See how this goes. You have All two... Right. Do you... I don't know if you get impact tests on a disorder. Do you get impact tests on a disorder? Yeah, it's, you, it's, 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 it's just no initiative, right? Yeah. yeah. Seven plus two. And your strength five impact hits. Yep, I need Ooh. fives. Fives to wound. I got four wounds on the Gorgon. We got two. Two, two wounding hits, okay. Uh, and that's it. got regeneration saves. I take both of them, and then you get all the orkies. You have Primal Fury as well. Uh, I pass, okay. I have to do separately, because you might be higher initiative with him. So these spears are going to go next. Got a One hit. One hit. Uh, five to wound? Nope. Uh, and then the pigs. Piggies hits. Strength four pigs. Uh, yeah, and AP one. I should be T6 on him. No wound from the pig. What's your initiative? Because I get no bonus. I think... 
Oh, yeah, because you don't get the initiative bonus on the disorder charge. Yeah, I go faster than him. I'm going to put all of my attacks into him, I guess. I risk it. Hey, hit him on threes. And uh, threes. that's wounds. Yeah, strength. Uh, killing blow doesn't matter because you're a chariot. But I do reroll. Is it one state or a wound with Primal Fury? Hit. Oh, because there's a one I got to reroll the hit then. Reroll the hit roll. Hits and uh, another wound. Three of them at minus two. Six of saves. Okay. You got one wound left. All right, and then you get to go before I stomp. Yeah. And your attacks. Two text. spears. Two hits. Um, Reroll one. Oh, yeah. One wound. Uh, your strength four. four. Yes, yeah. the one wound, yep. Right through my armor. We don't regen it. We take another damage. And piggies. Ah, uh, we're going to... We get some stomps. I'm going to stomp you there. One time. Doesn't wound either. That could be the big difference. Boom. So he's got one wound left. You did three damage to me. You have uh, two close orders, because your heavies are unit strength five, and you're in my flank. I did three damage to you, and I'm my, 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 I am my own close order, so I lose that combat by two. He is stubborn, so I just fall back in good order. Would you like to pursue with both of them? Uh, do we have to find out which way you go before I decide? Uh, I actually don't, I don't answer a legitimate question. Uh, we'll say yes, we figure it out. So four up, I run from this guy, because they're the same unit strength. So I'm running from that guy. So I'm gonna run this way. I will chase with both. Ah, uh, to go into that that fight there. Yeah. Ooh, get to fight again with them. That's pretty spicy. Oh, hopefully, I roll really low. I go four inches. Well, you're that, gonna pop through, right? I probably if I rolled like a double one, I might not have. Oh, fair. Die as I go through the giant. I have to do a peril check. So we're gonna go to keep going, and we're gonna end up right in front of these minotaurs right there. Sadly, uh, and then we get to reform, but we uh, have to do a peril check first. Hey, we're good. You're fine. And we get to reform. They're both going to turn to face that direction. And uh, I want to do the fresh one. Yep. I'll do one at a time. So this guy's not going to reform yet. I'll do the yep. fresh one first. Oh, wait, they don't, they don't reform. They pivot to face directly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, this one's going to test restraint because the goblin's going to be in the way. So go ahead and roll his test oh, restraint. Sure. Yeah. This guy's going to, that guy rolled a 10. So he's going uh, to. Gonna... He does. On a six? Yes, yes, yep. yes. yes, yes. So this guy is going to go ahead and follow up, and it counts as a charge. So we'll go right there. So we'll, just... we'll turn to face that way. Demonic figure. What a mess. And then this guy gets to reform. He does lose friends. We're probably going to reform to face this direction. Hopefully these guys get to fix their positioning based on all this nonsense as well. This is a hot mess and I love it. We have this fight. Chariots. Yep. Impact hit first. Hi. I got my impact hits as well. Oh, it's true. Sorry. I just supersede you. Ah, oh, you're tough this five? Two wounds at T5. We have a three up save on him with heavy armor, gnarled hide, and the pelt of the dark young. Uh, yeah, you haven't hit him with magic, right? So these should be five ups. We take one damage. Do you have the lucky talisman of protection, maybe? Nope, one damage. He's got four wounds remaining on him. Oh, he's actually toughness six. Oh, uh, so no I did no damage. No damage then. We're A-OK -okay for a demonic figure for this turn. Get his impact hit against the giant. He's a bull. That's a bull. Oh, real quick, before you go on. Yeah. Uh, sure. Uh, giant has his AP, right? One damage, yeah. Can you do a pay check for that chariot? Oh, yeah, that's true. That broke from combat. Uh, we're breaking. We're uh, fleeing. That is a... <laughs> Is that a fallback in good order? It's a fallback in good order. Yeah. And it's going to be a five. It'll be a fallback in good order. He rallies over there. There should be no other panics. That was from the Gorgon losing the combat. Okay. What weapon are you using? Ah, uh, we, we, got, we got you down to three wounds remaining now, eh? So if I use my hand weapons at the same time, if I use my great weapon, you get to go first. I'll just go with my uh, great weapon. Whatever. So your initiative's down to one. Uh, two on the charge. Three because of uh, demonic vigor. So 50-50, I throw you in my pants. Oh, is that how that works? I'm just gonna swing. It's not, yeah. not risking 50 50. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, giant stuff to hit. Oh. Maybe, you know what? I'm just gonna be safe and go hand weapon. Cause I forgot about the, it matters in my current initiative, right? Uh, I, I, I believe so. Rules as written, rules yeah. as intended, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not even gonna risk it. I'll just go hand weapon. I, yeah. No, no, I'm not, I'm, I'm yeah. not gonna. I know even, I, I forgot okay. about the pants thing. I wouldn't risk it. I wouldn't risk it at all. Yeah. No, I'm just trying to decide. I'm going to roll giant attacks. Do I yes. put it on the unit? Do I put it on the character? Yeah, because I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to commit to a hand weapon. Absolutely. Do Primal Furies before we get too far oh, into fair. this. Uh, he fails his Primal Fury, and then the Minotaurs, they pass theirs. Okay. Well, he I'm, has for the unit. Yeah, I'm going for the unit. Two. Whatever actually, that got is. my turtle. It's just a belly flop in the center of the unit, so two guys might get hit. Uh, what size is the blast? Three inches. One guy's hit for sure, because one guy's under the hole, and then one guy four up, yeah. So two, two hits, hits on the unit from Bellyfloss. Uh, this is strength six, AP two, so two, two AP two. That's just two, uh, that just kills this one guy. It's weird, that's the champion. 
Yeah, it's a interest, interesting interaction. The champion's only taking. Oh, he gonna he that. gonna die. Uh, and then he's got one wound left. Okay. Uh, uh, them. I think he's initiative seven. With all uh, the modifiers. So am I. Oh, fair. Yeah, go for. Yeah, you go ahead and do yours. Spears. Uh, Top of the six on my guy. One AP two because of uh, choppers. Choppers and the calf spear. Uh, that's gonna be a five up armor and a talisman. Oh, we're good. Right. Piggies oh. hits. Uh, nothing. They don't get uh, choppers. They don't get choppers. Gotcha. Okay. Ah, well, I, I guess... I chop him up! I'm going to try and kill... That's a weird... I don't know. Nice. They don't have any AP on him with the failed Primal Fury. I'm just going to try and go for the giant. He has five attack space, but he has Dark Fury. So he gets with the six attacks. I hit you on threes, I just assume. Yeah. <laughs> and I wound you on fours. You actually were hitting on twos. Oh, nice. Uh, well, I got... You should be... Ah, uh, you have six up saves. He's alive. I did roll a two to hit, I think. Uh, you might hit me. Okay, so yeah. let's see if it matters. It matters. Check if you're up to seven. Gotta double check it. I'm only web skill six. You got one wound left on him, and that means I get to fight with my champion into you. He's got a great weapon. So four attacks on the blood kind. Threes to hit. Ooh. Oh, no. Twos. He yeah, did. yeah, he did. Oh! I, false. I will choose. You choose to follow my giant. Oh, you choose a direction. I'm going to choose this face. Because I can only choose your yeah. facings, <laughs> so I'll choose backwards. It does no damage. Oh, my doom bowl. Right. So that separate, yeah. Combat resolution. I did four damage to the giant because I hit him with an impact hit for the extra one. And I have two. What is his? He's just a monstrous infantry. He's only used strength three, isn't he? Uh, yeah. So he doesn't get close. Oh, he's a skirmish anyways. Uh, so one closed order for them. I don't think they apply that anymore because they're not part of the combat. I don't, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not saying this for sure. I don't think they're, I don't think any of their stuff matters other than com, other than damage. Just the damage. Oh, cause it's like what's but left I might over. Be, I might be wrong about that. You know that. what, That that's the logical thing. I'm gonna go ahead and go with that route because they're, that's, he doesn't care about that anymore. But he cares about the damage, I suppose. So we had four damage in the combat. I'd rather do it right than get it wrong. Um, well, you know, we'll see if it matters. Okay, fair, fair, fair. Cause they would contribute two more combat res with closed order and banner. Otherwise, I got the damage. So I got four damage, and I had a flank. Uh, if that even No, you're not the flank. You're definitely, you're definitely not the flank. Yeah. Because he's dead. Yeah. I'm in the flank, and I have clothes. So you just have two. So I went by two. Uh, it didn't matter. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. It didn't matter at all. Um, I'm just going to... What do you, you want to do? I. You're going to run directly away. I'll catch the goblins, eh? Do I want to fight goblins? Yeah, whatever. I'll fight... Ah, do I just want to restrain and protect them? Kill goblins? Ah, whatever. I'll chase. I don't care. He's a bulldog. Why think about it? Now, before I do commit to the chase, sorry. Because I can't remember if he only rolls a d6 or not. Okay, I'm just going to restrain, save myself. I don't. I must chase. Perfect. Done. Panic! They're panicked! Panic! They went through them both. Ah, oh, uh, yes. So uh, they're going to go... <laughs> he goes over that way. I must chase. He does have blood greed, though, so he's only going to go four inches. That away. All right. Does that mean they get to reform? Because they, oh, absolutely. Yeah, they can test to reform on them. They might have to over... If I fail, they have to overrun. <laughs> Ah, uh, they get to reform. Excellent. They'll reform facing that way. The champion is the one wound model over there. That's the end of my turn. That's the end of my turn. We're on to Orcs turn three. <laughs> Nothing's in range for rallying cry, so we'll go right to your spell casting. Oh, uh, there's only one spell I want to cast is the reroll ones to hit an extra AP. Evil Sun Shining. You got yeah. a ten. I mean that's I don't even I don't even know what's gonna happen anymore. Uh evil sun shining, evil sun shining. I'll let yeah. I'll try a fade to spell. I don't know, whatever. You got it. Rallying! He uh, is. They are not rallying. Run! Oh, ten. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. We'll fight over there. That's fine. Cool. Right, cool these cool. two boys. Double ones for them. They are uh, gonna keep running. They go uh, off the table. They're off the table. Yep. Uh, these gabarinos. Oh, they rally back in, baby! And they can move fully too. So. I'm going to these and guys right here. Double ones on them. They're right and here. they're off the table. Eleven inches. Do I have any more? I have a chariot over here. Chariot and God. Oh, no, they, they, uh, they fell back in good order. Yep. Chariot rallies. Seven should be good, yep. Char uh, down, right? Yeah. I don't want to charge with them. On a one to three, you do. Oh, they're charging. Okay, charge. Okay, so here the charges. Is he charging anyway? He can't oh, charge. He, he rallies. Oh, that guy's charging, yeah. right? Yep. All right, so start from the far side. We're going to go run you down. Yep. Uh, what can he charge, Luca? Uh, he could charge. Whichever one's closer, I'm going to charge whichever one's closer. Oh, but those are definitely in your arc. What about the giant? You want to go I don't think he's in my arc. I'd rather get the giant. That one I'm iffy on, yeah. Yeah, so the boss is going to go after the, bull, the bulls. Gotcha. This chariot's going to go after that chariot. And the goblins have to go after this boss. Understood. Understood. Okay. I uh, am so over to here to here. I'll hold. Whatever. Check it out. Where are the goblins going? Uh, the Ascots are him. Ah, uh, well, he's going to hold. And the wyvern is going to go for the minotaurs there. I kind of want to flee. 
but I don't know if that does anything for me. They'll just eat the charge and hope for the best. And that was, and then this guy is being charged by this chariot, eh? Oh, he's gonna get run down real bad. He's just gonna go flee because I'll go through the giant at this angle. Uh, hopefully that'll keep him alive and hopefully I rally next turn <laughs> so I can cast spells. So yeah, he'll flee. I'll roll that up. He is gonna go six inches, which will probably put him on the giant. This is just enough to pop through the giant. He lands around his back foot there. Everybody else holding? Everyone else is holding, yeah. yeah. I'll test the redirect into the giant. Yep. That's easy. I can? Uh, that's a pass. Uh, he's gonna go... Four, eight... Plus nine? Four. 17? I don't think so. Redirects in the giant, but the charge is a fail. And because of the wood slowing it down, we realize. Let's, uh, let's do my boss man. I oh, I have Warband. Oh, go ahead and reroll it. Uh, still I still take one the one. And... Oh, jeez, okay. Um... Warband reroll, it's still a fail charge, but you're gonna fail for it a couple of more inches. Wyvern! Wyvern time! He's nine, plus uh, four. Plus seven? Yep, that's 16? Is that enough? Oh, yeah. Okay. It works out good for you. Your, mi your minimum movement disallowed maximizing against my Minotaur there. Uh, one more inch of movement and you could have maximized more. Yeah. This guy right here. Oh, oh more bent. <laughs> yeah. There Send him in. And these stupid goblins. I'm not going to use... Uh, Anything on that. So... You still make it? I made it. <laughs> Even with those fist right and rerolling because yeah. of Warband, they still make the charge. Let's go! <laughs> Thanks for the free reform, idiots. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't matter who's the skirmisher. Awesome. Now that guy's free to move. Uh... Geez. Getting out of the charge arc of the Minotaur blood kind. Don't forget, he is still closed order in all the way he moves, so he can't uh, freely move around as a skirmisher. And then the Goblin Wolf Riders reform, move around a little bit, just to get out of the charge yeah, arc. Yeah, we're trying well. to get shots going here. We're gonna yeah. do some, oh, where's your wizard? Oh, you within... Right you have to spell now. I popped through. Uh, I don't know if I get... I'm fleeing. I don't know if I get to Oh, you're right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, gaze. I'm going to do the line where I zap through a bunch of things. You're going to hit... Um, no, I'm going to try to kill these two models. Oh, you want to hit these two? Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey. Oh, four. Uh, eight? Is this spell... Is Gaze is nine to cast. Oh, we both got a bunch of nines to cast if we're failing. Oh. Who's? Bow. Oh, wait, it's here. It's... I'm going to try Bow's next. I so assume three, the big six. guy right beside him. No, we're going... Oh, that big down. guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're going to have fives for range. Ooh, not bad, Perfect. though. Six is to wound. Two wounds. Oh, yeah, he's only got left. one on him. Uh, he armors one. Another six. Nope, he did. So timber, but he's on combat, so it won't do much. That's a good kill. Vindictive glare to take out the other one. Oh my <laughs> gosh, you got it. It wounds. I got to regen, but still. You need regen. No, you need regen. Hey. He does not. Oh no. You got, I got him both. off the table. <laughs> off the table with two goblins and a random spell. Outstanding, <laughs> outstanding move. And like <laughs> usual, the game has somehow flipped itself on me. <laughs> we'll do this one. Right. Impact. This it's one. It's gonna I, be five. This one I know is not gonna Threes. be Threes. Okay, two at minus one. Uh, at minus no, two. I uh, take one damage. Mm. All right, let's spear you. Spears. Uh, uh, two hits. Double hits. One wound, AP two. Six up. Oh, he's dead. I had Primal Fury, but I didn't let's need to worry about it. Test restrain. He does. Yeah, let's turn and face all the directions. Hey, right, we're on to the goblin fight. You Four have. Four miles, five attacks. <sighs> one hit. Oh, I gotta do my. Uh, no wounds. Ooh, thing. We pass. Wolves. I got a wound. Right. Oh, I got a wound? Yeah. Armor? We're good. Okay. He's got three. Up. You go. Got six attacks. Hitting on. Oh, you want to go two? two? Yeah. <laughs> Primal Fury. These are just great weapon attacks. I'm just being lazy. Uh, it didn't matter if they're four dead. I got one left. One? Oh, the champion, too. Uh, I don't double outnumber you, but you got a pretty bad combat resolution here. Please, I'm fine. Uh, you're falling back in good order. Because I don't double outnumber you, leadership eight, fall back in good order. I'm going to test restrain. We're good. We'll be panic. a panic for him, though. He's okay. okay. And panic. panic. Yeah, yeah, they're panic. okay. Perfect. He's going to go. Six. Nine. Just oh, six. Pop through the chariot. This guy will be free to act. Could change his direction, but he can see all before him. Okay, this guy's supposed to be like this. Yeah, that's right. I don't know, I don't know how he moved. You're coming uh, after me. Come on. We're going for a general fight in a second. Uh, this fight over here. Okay. I'll do Primal Fury. <laughs> yep. I pass it. You do. So we get to reroll hit rolls of one. You know, the war boss first. Two of his attacks are going to go into my blood kind. Uh, threes. Oh, good start. And uh, I'm strength five. It should be five. Those With are two, two wounds. wounds. AP one. Because of choppers. Yeah. Uh, that's a great weapon guy. That just so kills him. That's just him dead, yeah. Which is only worth one because it's yeah. not a challenge. I'll keep that one over there. And then the unit. Threes. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. 
Okay. Yeah, oh, good. just double hand weapon. That's right. Yep. I guess my wyvern definitely goes before I do. Got a venomous tail attack as well. Uh, oh, this would have went into your. That's um, fine. We can easily resolve that. Because this has to strike first. Yep. 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 Uh, that w that would wound at AP nothing into your champion. What strength is it? Six. Yes, that's true. Okay, so I have a. Uh... Okay, so that, that kills the champion, and then the two wounds from the orc boss would do two damage to this guy. So that's what we have going on now. So a lot more efficient because of the tail, and then. Yeah, the t I, I thought the tail was may, but it's a must. Oh, and the tail's two, clutch. Yep. Two wicked claws. Okay. All right. Well. <laughs> I still I get stomps, but I still get this guy's full complement of attacks and this guy's one attack because the this guy over here is in the fighting rank and died. You on fours with my great weapons. No, nice. re no rerolls. Your toughness. Uh, six. Ooh, that's thick. Oh yeah, because you're on a mount. Uh, you strength seven. Yeah, three to wound then. Uh, two wounds at minus two. The armor and troll hide. Two six ups and regens. Two five ups and I believe two more five ups. Oh, the, okay. Yeah, okay. Fail all three of them. Okay. Oh, you have talisman protection. Yes, sir. How many wounds does he have left? Uh, let me tell you, I totally know the answer to that. So the Wyvern is plus four, so I have five left. Yeah, I was going to say. Uh, you probably have four wounds on the Orc War Boss. There's only three. All right. All right, five wounds left. You get your stomps. Oh, yes. D3 stomps. Uh, three Ooh. and twos. Strength six. Uh, no AP, though. I'm not a behemoth. That is going to kill one more off, leaving me with the musician. Or, sorry, banner. Six combat. Uh, it's six wounds in combat, and I did two to you, so you're up by four. And you get a closed order. And I have two damage to you and a banner. So I lose by two. However, you have terror. Oh, I don't care about the terror. Uh, but uh, the no, trophies I care about. Uh, terror is a rule that if you lose combat with them all, with this rule is minus one. Right. However. Ooh. So, yeah, it's minus. Uh, double checking. Yeah, fear does not downgrade terror to fear. Units that have fear, fear units that cause terror. But terror is immune to terror. In this case, it would be negative one to my leadership for grizzly trophies as well as the terror on the wyvern. However, that reduces his characteristic. He's going to use his characteristic for the yes, booster sir. check. I don't love that. That's kind of how it's always worked. In it's all right. It's, it is what it is. It, I, that's how it works. I'm a big fan of psychology lists. Sure. So I, I sure. like I like psychology to come. I would like for this to work as well, but yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah. I, I think this is technically how it's always worked. Anyway, I, I gotta do. I, I gotta go with your. I have to go through your general, right? Uh, we pass because of the general. Well, we give ground. Fair. Would sure. you like to restrain and reform, um, or just follow up? Hmm. I'm gonna follow up. One, two ish, and you'll go same thing. I got a lot of models left. <laughs> We're losing models. I didn't start with a lot of models, but this somehow flipped on itself, and I don't really know where it all where it all went wrong. Luca, do me a stupidity, please. Yes, it's, it is. It <laughs> so is. Don't delay it. Oh god. Why are you wearing a fez? Nobody can see you. Your no, head. I'm not wearing a fez. You can't just say why are you wearing a fez and uh, just... hold on, I'll give you a mirror. Keep the camera no, on me. No, there is no fez. <laughs> stupidity. He's good. Gaze of the gods. <laughs> He's good. Oh, uh, that is. Initiative or toughness? It's, yeah, one of those. It Ooh, is toughness. toughness. It's only for the turn, though, so we don't have to worry, uh, worry about tracking that. Past stupidity. Got toughness for the gaze of the gods. Still has dark fury for the extra attack. I am going to go to my... Uh, missing my conjuration yeah. step, going right to rally. Nice. Oh! He's in it. He's good. He can cast magic <laughs> missiles. Yes, I do have charges to declare. I'm going to go, obviously, for the yep. general fight. <laughs> um, so charge there. Pretty much it for charging. So... We're gonna go, ooh, 12. I'll uh, measure it. <laughs> no, <laughs> we're good. That's like an eight or a nine. Get out of here, whoosh. Just end up something like that. He rallied, he's gonna move five. 24 is gonna be hard to dodge over there, so we're just gonna probably move him here, just so I can get line of sight to that. He's only got one wound on him. Boop, boop. Uh, and then our giant is going to turn. Um, I wonder, he's gonna back up. And uh, lumber, I guess. Ah, oh, it's gonna block him though. I didn't realize the movement was gonna be so complicated there. So I had to move him to the point where I can see this thing barely. And uh, the giant's gonna move backwards three, and then lumber, he's gonna face lumber that way. He's gonna expose himself, but I'm hoping that the giant can just deal with that goblin. And this guy's just gonna reform where he was. Uh, just to face the combat, I suppose. Everything, all the nonsense going on. Oh, that stupid goblin's in the back. Uh, so he'll do a 90 degree turn because of the die. I always try to keep a die to know where he ends up going. The FAQ, though. I know, I know, I know. The FAQ. Uh, that's too... It. He's going to end up moving around here, I guess. He will welcome death gladly. Uh, this should be it for my movement. We can go right to shooting, which is this wizard over here. He's going to try a ruby ring of ruin first. 
He fails. And the summoning. I need... That's a good, not a bad roll. We'll I'm, try it. 11 to stop it. Oh, Ooh. close. We're going to target this thing with a summoning. 2d6, strength 4 hits. It will be 8. A 5 to wound? Just 1. Minus 1, I think. Oh, the chariot holds! I forgot how to see the shadows. I don't really need it, but funny that I was doing do all that. Do you want to do it? No, because I... It's fine where he is. I just wanted to hit this thing with a magic missile. All right to fighting over here. Probably your toughness, like, what, seven or six on him? I'll probably just go great six. weapon. Yeah, I'll go great weapon. Right. I don't care. I got Wyvern has to go first. Who are you going for? Has to go. We'll go him. Oh, sure. Uh, hits. Are yeah, you about to go five on the Wyvern? It is, it is. And oh, wound. Oh, jeez. Uh, we don't save it. Weapons Griffins? Weapons go, is it Griffin Weapons go five? Eagles? Uh, they're Weapons go four. Are they? No, they're five. What? Yeah. I guess I play with all the bad weapon <laughs> you skill monsters. Bad I'm used to monster web. Mo to me, monsters web skill three and four. Dragons are all six plus. Dragons don't count. Those are dragons. That's like a different character. That's a different class of monster. Yeah, yeah. It's a baby dragon. It's a wyvern. That's true. You know what? That's a good argument. That is a good argument. I like it. Uh, okay. Uh, what about the rest of your attacks? I'm only initiative uh, four for the charge here. Hmm. Oh, you primal furies. Primal oh. fury. Uh, pass. Primal fury. Dang! I'm not getting these primal furies. Let's get the damage going on him. Yeah, I'll just make sure he's dead. Boom and uh, one. One woony hit. Uh, AP nothing on that because you, you just followed up on a give yeah. ground. Yeah, overtake damage all the same. And then my mount, which is actually I'm not sure, but uh, who looks at him? So we're gonna try to kill him off. Ooh, kill him. AP two. wicked claw. Yeah, that'll kill him. Oh, he's worth two. He's worth a full three, actually. All right, let's see what the Doom Bolt. I don't expect to like one shot you or something, but like in a. It could happen. Well, I think I think I have the I have the same. I have the saves. I have six attacks with him with his great weapon. Uh, you're up skill six on your war boss. Ooh, yes. Yeah. Fours. Oh, I didn't get any ones, anyways. Twos. Uh, four at minus two. Six of saves. Okay, not bad. And talisman. Then, um. Yeah, talisman fractions first. And then Nothing. regens. Well, this is the combat res, at least. I do one damage to you, but it's three combat res. But not that it matters too much. I was actually initial three on the mount. Okay. So is this guy faster that I killed? Uh, no, I had a great weapon. That's oh, a great okay. weapon. A great so weapon stomps then will be one attack, and it wounds. Oh, just not wounds. Six. Yeah, I forgot my impact against you. It. What's your toughness? Six. No, that's not a wound then. Did three wounds to my Minotaur with a banner. Not bad start. And you have uh, closed order with you to strength five or more. I did three damage to you and I'm in your flank. Because you regen two of them. Nice. That's a tie. Beautiful. Nice. This is turn five, four actually, yeah. We're gonna do the spell where I reroll ones to hit and get extra AP. I got it, but you're in range. That's right, so I need an eight. Nope. Good, I'm actually gonna make use for this turn. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna do any impetu. Oh, uh, I'm gonna see if the goblin has to charge. Gotcha, one, two, three, he does. He has to charge, okay, so. Goblin's gonna charge him. Yep. These two will charge him. Gotcha. This guy can't see anything, and they can't get to anything. So that's it. I, I, so part of me wants to flee there, but you can just redirect in the. Well, that guy can redirect. Yeah, you know what? I will flee. Uh, so he'll flee, and then what was he doing? He's not doing anything. Oh, he, okay. He's not even picturesque. And then just that over there. Yep. Okay, so I'll hold there. So fleeing the bull. Uh, I think I don't know which one. I think I've randomized where I flee from, but all the same. I'm gonna go, oh, not far, five inches. So I'll put a five beside him, then I'm gonna figure out where I go. One, two, three, I flee from that guy. I'm fleeing from that guy. Rolling up. That one's going to go. War, uh, I'll, war band. I'm just going to get farther up the field. Ooh, six plus, that's, uh, I don't know, it's probably a fail. And then that guy's gonna go, ooh, six. This one ends up catching him. That one fails to there. This one's gonna go kaboom and kill that Minotaur. He ra reforms after that. Uh, nope. No, all right, fine. <laughs> I'm just gonna screw, go over there and scram off. We gotta just come, oh no, we wanna get within eight of him so I can give him buffs. Yep. And then we're gonna zap things. And then these guys are already measured, I can wheel and then make it to the woods, start chucking bows. Ah, oh, shooting bows. They do have to do uh, checks though for going to the woods, they're okay. And then this guy's obviously gonna make it, doesn't need to do much, just go. Right we do have a rally over here. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> do I get a cherry kill? You got him. Hey, <laughs> not bad. Hey, that was terror. Attempt of vindictive glare. One vindictive glare. It's scary. I uh, don't stop it. Who's Two's going for wound? it? I only hit one target. Oh, the wizard, yes. <laughs> Everything else is in combat. Uh, I don't have a protect. Oh, what do I got? I'm Ruby Ring and Earth and Rod. That's it. Roll it up. Dead. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Come on. A hell of a stare. He's dead. Boom. Let's go fight the giant. Just like that. Uh, you have an issue. No, no. We're going to fight here first because you kill me. You need to search forward. 
Ah, uh, true actually. Good call. <laughs> Good call. Everyone's a stab. It hits. It wounds. Wounds. Uh, AP nothing. Three up, yeah. Uh, three up armor. Oh, jeez. Talisman. Okay, we take a damage. Four wounds left on him, and then uh, I'm only initiative one, so. Oh, okay. Um, do you want to do Primal Fury? Oh, yeah, I would love to, actually. Hey, we pass. We roll ones. It's man. Hitting on fours. Re rolling ones, and we're strength that's, five, so. That's because of Evil Sunshine. And... Yeah. Uh, what's your toughness? Uh, it's two wounds, five. Wounds. Yeah, two wounds. Two wounds, four up saves. Damn. Talisman protection. Hey, yeah. Oh, I fails them both. Uh oh. Uh, down to three. And. I've done three wounds, you've done two. Did Kill I got you. Yeah, no, I was correct. Because <laughs> yeah. the, the I couldn't right. just yeah, yeah. get you. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> it's one hit. And that might be poison, actually. It does not wound, but uh, it might be poison. Oh, if it is, we're good. Right. Six attacks on fours. I reroll ones. Oh, only two hits. Boo. And two wounds at minus two. Six up. Six up. Oh. Five aboard. Oh, nice. Five and... regen. Oh. Take a wound. And that is that. We stomp ya. Yes, that's true. There's only one. Oh, D3 stomps. It uh, wounds. Strike yes, six. it does. Armor? We're good. Because no AP, no thunder stomps on that guy. I think I won. You did, you did. So you have three combat res on me with a closed order. I got one on you in the flank. I'm going to lose that one by two, but now we're going to suffer terror and um, the, the trophy rack. We're looking at leadership six, so we're going to break there. Cause that, because he lowers my leadership characteristic. So now my threshold for breaking is over a seven plus now. And I assume you want to chase. I'm going to chase. Absolutely. And that is game over. No, we're not. I'm going to first try it. Oh, did you get away? Oh, well, it's all the same. I'll still concede same on that. Same thing. No, we will do this fight. Oh, yeah, saying? we got to do this fight. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. All right, now on to this fight over here. You get to go first. I have four impact hits. Ooh, oh, it's D3 plus one. I have one wound. Uh, is it strength five? Yeah. Oh, it's a ch goblin chair strength five. Uh, it's a damage. Three spears. Oh, one wound. wound. Uh, right to my armor is a calf spear. Three wolves. And Nothing. You could, I'm only initiative three, I think, so the the boss is going to be faster. He's like initiative five or six, charging the rear. Three's the hit. Ooh. Four is to wound. One more wound. Oh, down to three. And then giant table. Hey. Six. Oh, just jump up and down. Jump up. Oh, three of them. Um, your toughness, probably two's to wound here. Yep. Uh, three troll pan saves. My pants. Oh. Take one wound. All right, one wound. Hey, stop me. And D6. Three of them. And twos. Uh, six up saves and regen. Oh, three of them, actually. Uh, six up? And then regen. What's the AP? Uh, it's Thunder Stomps, two. So it's five up save. That doesn't matter. Oh, you have armor, silver, steel. I thought yeah. you were four. Yeah, <laughs> And then, course, um, pants. So you still take, take two, more? two more, but you regen to two of those. Yes, so that's five combat reds. Did three to me on the way in there. You're in my rear. Boom. And you're a light chariot. It's so no extra combat res there. I did five combat res to you, and I'm closed order. Oh, you went by one. One by one. Ooh, terror as well. Seven? Uh, he is going to help out here. Yeah, so you're good. Right. You're going to uh, fall back in good order. Or give, yeah. Fall back and give around. Something like that, whatever. Let's give around. It's all the same. I, I will. I my test. I'd follow up. Probably try and smash him. Ah, oh, this guy's not dead, I guess. But I don't have the points to win. I can't. You could just fly and save points I'm going to zap things to death now. Yeah, you could zap things to death. At this point, you could also just um, flee and everything could move away. And then, because you're all chariots, you could not commit to the fight. And I could probably get this fight. I'll just do this one one more time on my turn. That's all I'd be able to do. Fair. Boom. Um, I'm initiative three, so you probably have all the goblins. All right, so first. goblins and wolves. Got a wound. Nice. Excellent. Six up armor. Nope. Two. And you're faster than the great weapon. Hey, six again. Two. Oh, that's a, that's a belly flop. Let's go. Does it wound? No. Stomps. Uh, oh, yeah, great great weapon. weapon. Same time. Same time. Oh, yeah. That's true, actually. Uh, uh, nothing. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> and I stomp. Ooh. There we go. Five, a six. I wound on twos. Uh, five ups. Five, five ups. Oh, five of them. Ooh, nice. And then pants. Oh, oh dead. <laughs> Goblin War boss dies on the chariot. Nice. Oh, not bad, not bad. It'd reform or overrun or whatever. Oh, uh, boom. But we're going to lose on points because uh, Steve can just save points on this. All I have left is this guy at two wins. Well, check if you can rally. Uh, that's true. Does he rally? He would have rallied. <laughs> oh, double wins too. So he would rally and he would be in the fight, but uh, Steve could just save points. I got my wizard. Point. Yep. I got my chariots. Damn. That's crazy. I don't know where that went wrong. That's it for this one. That's it for this game here, folks. But Steve and I are going to jump into a post game. We'll talk about the game in general, old world in general. What a game. And, uh, you know, just the, the style of these kinds of lists and how it still kind of turned out to be a 
pretty weird game and uh, pretty enjoyable all the way to the end there. And uh, as always, you'll know, stick around. There will be more Old World to come out on YouTube. And then uh, we're just going to go hang out with our uh, members for a bit there on miniwargame.com. Sorry, I talked too much. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't give myself a chance to breathe. Happy Wargaming, everyone. Toodaloo.